Hello and welcome to Dee Dee Blooms. Today I was just watering my very large Cymbidium, which I got last year in April from a local garden nursery at 50% off. It was um, originally priced at $60. I got it for $30 and just an amazing price for such a large plant. It's been doing really well for me uh, since I got it last April in 2021. I've had it hanging out on my patio, uh, right about that location where those white hanging baskets are out there. But I got scared this year with some of the temperatures. We were getting close to freezing. So I brought all my orchids in and I made a huge mistake with this poor plant. So with any new activity or something you're learning about, we all make mistakes. And so I thought this was a good opportunity. I was just watering this and I'm like, I need to share what I did and what I did wrong with everyone. So uh, this plant, when I brought it in from outside, had two beautiful flower spikes that were forming. There's one, here's the other one. And as I brought them in, I wanna say about a month and a half ago, the flower spikes were already about this high. Uh, they weren't forming buds yet. They were still just spikes. Uh, shortly thereafter, bringing them in, the, bud, the flower buds started coming out and it kept growing taller and taller and just this beautiful flower spike. And the same with this one. Beautiful, beautiful, I had all these buds, and as you can see, I am left with one. Just one out of about 40 I had last counted. Here is some of the massacre that fell off. So I have experienced almost total bud blast. I am just hoping and hoping this one little guy will flower for me. All the time and energy this plant put into these flower spikes and the mistake I made was moving it while it was in spike. Never, never, never move your cymbidium plant when it is in spike. I should have uh, covered it maybe with a light sheet instead of bringing it inside with the concern of the temperatures. And because I didn't do my research before rushing everything in, I am left with bare, beautiful flower spikes. So sad. So as people make mistakes, they learn. I will never forget this. And I will uh, definitely never move a cymbidium that is in spike. So please wish me luck that this one flower will open for me so that I may enjoy the one out of about 40. So if you have any comments or questions, please let me know. Uh, I'm getting close to moving this plant outside. I'm giving that last flower bud a chance to show me what it might do. 
and then it'll go back in its spot and it will never be moved again. <laughs> so I hope everyone has a great day. I hope they learn something from this and, and never, never move your Cymbidium plant, which is in spike. If you're gonna move it, move it when it's not in spike so that you don't experience this. <sighs> All right, I wish everyone a good day. Stay healthy and safe. Thank you so much for watching. Oh, little flower bud, you are my only hope. Please bloom for me.